Welcome back. Today we have this problem called sort integers by the number of one bits. Uh, we are giving an integer array uh, called R. Uh, sort the integers in the in the array in ascending order by the number of uh, ones in their binary representation. And in case of two or more integers uh, have the same number of uh, one of ones, you have to sort them in ascending order. Okay. So let's just say that we have this array we are returning this array instead and because the explanation is zero is uh, is the only integer with the zero bytes one two and four and eight are with one byte three five six have two bytes and seven have three bytes so because of that we sorted them we thought them in this way <coughs> so um, the solution will come to we have to do some some um um it's a pretty simple solution we we will we will do maybe like we we first to start maybe we we um we creating another array and uh, and uh, we will count the byte and we will sort them and uh, let let's just let's just see how we can do that so first of all just i'll just let rest equals um uh, um, array new array and this array will be um, uh, from uh, array uh, dot length I want it because it will be have the same length and it will be dot fill uh, of zeros and in the end I will return this array return this and the thing that I'm going to say right now the what I'm thinking about I'll make a for loop and uh, it will be mm, let um, i i equals zero i um, i less than what is that less than uh, r the length and I'll say i plus plus and we have our own array and i want to store in this race each the each uh, byte count of each element in uh, array of i so let's just before doing anything let's create a function that create the that counts the bytes so i will say uh, count byte and i'll have in and I will have um, let uh, res also equals uh, equals zero, and I'm return. I will return this res, and I will say um, while n doesn't equals <coughs> zero, we continue looping. Okay, I will say um, res it will be plus or equals and i'll make a check here if in uh, one and um, in equals one what that means what that means i know i know what it is. so just um so we initialize the variable zero okay which will store the count of of, of the bytes and uh, we loop we will continue loop until until uh, n becomes uh, zero okay um in each iteration res uh, is incremented by uh, by uh, n um uh oh, so, sorry my eyes uh, uh so res is incremented by um n uh, one which checks if, if uh, basically we are checking if uh, if the least significant uh, bit of of n is one. If it is like that, it means there is a, a set of bits so we can increment the count. Uh, the n is uh, right shifted by uh, one. B uh, we like we uh, we right shifting by one bit using uh, this one. We are right shifting by one bit and um this uh, uh this uh, this operator do this for us and this shift 
basically this shift this shifts all bytes of into uh, the right by one position if uh, effectively this uh, discarding the the least significant bit um, the loop will continue to until uh, all bits of n have been uh, processed finally the value of uh, the res represents the count of the set of bits in uh, the binary representational of uh, the original n and in, in conclusion of this function, this code uh, uses uh, bitwise operations to iterate through the bits of um, of integer and count the number of set bits. So this is w this is actually the the, the was the was the hottest part of, of the solution. So after we continue after we uh, counted the bits, I will say I will say uh, res of uh, sorry there's something in my eyes it's hurting oh shit this of eyes will equals count bit and i will put to it array of i of course multiplied by the famous number No, no, it's I'll, I'll put a ray of i and after that I'll multiply it by 100. And yeah, it's an, an array of i. And by this way, we'll know the count byte of each one of them. Okay, and uh, to make sure that we are sorting them, I would say res dot sort uh, a and b and just. It will be a minus b, and I will say for uh, for I will say let uh, i equals uh, a zero. Uh, I uh, uh, less than n, and uh, i plus plus. And I will say I will say res of i because I want to get the real numbers. It will be modded. It will it will equals whatever eh, it will equals whatever we modded on one zero 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 one because right now we want to make them a byte. Other that we want to mod them so we got the real numbers. And yeah, that's it, I guess. Yeah, what is in actually? It's a ray of length. Yeah, voila, it's working nice. So that's it for this problem. Hope that my solution was quite good and see you in future problem. And before you leave, make sure to subscribe, hit the notification bell so you will never miss a video.